guest is a seasoned movie and still photographer. He's a veteran, having worked with renowned actors such as Adrian Brody, Blythe Danner, the late Robin Williams, the list goes on and on. Well, in 2020, he traveled across the United States with his film editor to uncover an unfiltered, unflinching portrait of America. The documentary touches on politics and race, love and immigration. America Unfiltered, Portraits of a Nation is an unvarnished vision of our shared humanity. My guest is Horacio Marquinez. Welcome to you. Welcome. Thank you. That right. sounds really nice. Thank you. Oh, you betcha. First things first. When did you first pick up a camera? As a kid, mm. an adult? As a kid. As a, As a kid, yes. In Panama? Or In where? Panama, where I, where I was born. And uh, my, my dad gave me my first camera, actually. Yes. I so, love stories like yes. that. All right. In 2020, what was the thinking, oh, let's just travel across America and see what we see? Tell me that story. Well, I was trapped, like many others, well, most of us were trapped in, in here in New Haven. In the pandemic? In the pandemic. Yeah, it. So I call a friend my editor and, and dear friend, and they say, you wanna come with me? It will be just maybe three weeks and we'll just, we'll fly you back. <laughs> and the three weeks turned into, into nine months on the road. What did you find as you started to talk to people in this country? What I found was that the Americans, or the people that we found, wanted to share what they had or what they have and share their life, and they were so generous. That thing that was one thing that I just found. Now, Horacio, when you were out driving in the car, January 6th happened at the Capitol. Where were you, and you said, we gotta get there? As with all this was happening, and, and um, from Jacksonville, we were in Atlanta, that's when we realized, okay, January 6th is coming. So you're in Washington. We're looking at some of the pictures. What did you see and hear there as a, as a filmmaker right in the heart of this? In D.C., on the 6th, um, it, was, it was strong. It was, a, it was the energy. It was, was un, un, unbelievable. Um, we were just surrounded by just thousands of thousands of people. Were you ever afraid with all that was going on around you? So it was not about my feelings, it was about what was around me. Get the moment. And, and be in the moment, and I knew that I was stepping into history. You and certainly were. Yes. All right, so this documentary is going to be uh, screened at the Arts and Ideas Festival in New yes. Haven in June. Um, along with an exhibit, an exhibit of your photos yes. of this documentary. What are your thoughts about that? I am very excited, because I, if this is, uh, it's been uh, three years in the making. It's been editing and collecting images and, and curating and, and, and showing the project and, and evolving. And now we have a very well tight curated, a tight story, a movie that it really tells our story. And not only our story, but a story of what we experience in America. Thank you. Horacio, thank you so much for being with me. And good luck with this amazing documentary. Thank you so much, thank you. You bet. And if you would like to know more about Horacio Marquinez, go to WTNH.com or the News 8 app.